Hey folks, your OS Reviews. You're watching our video first look and a quick review of the Naughty. This is a smart Bluetooth light which connects with an Android or iOS smartphone to give you quick notifications. So if you have it in the kitchen or maybe in the office, you can simply glance at the light if it's flashing a certain color that you can program when you know you get a new call, a text message, or uh, some sort of incoming social media notification. It's also on Amazon for 50 bucks, which I think is a little bit on the pricier side of the spectrum, but the company, Witty Design, has also produced some rather unique looking gadgets in the past, and they kind of blend the edge between technology and art, so perhaps it's something to consider if you're looking into uh, a unique piece of uh, tech. So the Naughty that you see here, uh, this is a box that it comes in. You can see you have some basic info on the sides, so social media notifications will pulse. You can also use it as a wake up light, which is kind of nifty. So the light will start to get brighter and brighter when you uh, near a alarm time. So it simulates the sun rising very slowly. There's also the ability for it to control different music modes to flash, but there isn't a speaker built in. Um, otherwise it uses a simple LED for mood lighting, has up to seven, 720 hours in notification mode after you charge the battery. It takes about two hours to completely charge using micro USB. Some basic info on the other sides as well. So this company has also produced the uh, Dotty, which is another notification light, but that has a kind of more interesting interface going on. But this one is a more uh, kind of almost avant-garde looking art piece. It looks like a sculpture almost, and we'll show you that later on. So this is what the box looks like. Inside you have access to a quick start guide, along with the QR code that you can scan to download the app for iOS and Android. And underneath here we have just the light itself. There's also a micro USB cable included, which allows you to quickly charge it up. Uh, it can operate when it's charging as well. And again, the cable itself kind of matches the design language of the unit because it has this prism look. It's also made out of plastic and has a flat ribbon wire to, pre pre to prevent any tangling. So setting things things off to the side and taking a look just at the Noti, uh, you can see that as a fan of Marvel's Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D., it almost reminded me of the Tesseract or the obelisk that was going on in some earlier seasons, and this kind of is an interesting conversation starter, definitely, when you place it on a surface or a desk. It's also a little bit smaller than I originally expected just by looking at the packaging, but anyways, the construction quality here seems to be pretty good. It's a one-piece plastic material, again, has an interesting prism-like shape. Uh, this, the top just features a logo, the Witty logo, which you use as a power on-off switch. Tap on that for a few seconds to turn it on and start the pairing mode. The bottom features a few ventilation grills to prevent overheating. There's also a reset pin, and the back features a micro USB port for charging, and that's basically it. A very simple design. Again, there isn't a speaker built in, so it doesn't also act as a Bluetooth piece. So Bluetooth tapping on the Witty logo to turn on the unit. You can see that the default light is set to green, but I can change that through the application. Which, speaking of, we can take a quick look at what that looks like next. Uh, I can also mention that when the actual light is on, you can see that the edges of the prism seems to have a darker tone or color to it, which casts a very interesting shadow and overall look. It gives it almost a dark look. Uh, it does cast a omnidirectional light, so it spreads light rather evenly. It is bright enough to be used as a reading light, perhaps at night, or definitely as a desk lamp if you're traveling. Uh, and it overall is a pretty attractive, I would say, lamp. So here is the application. It's called the Not. Uh, the Naughty, and it's a free app that you can use uh, to download from the App Store. So first I'm going to repair this, and it finds the Naughty automatically. I can also pair up to two of these if I purchase a pair. Kind of interesting, but afterwards you can control the color quite easily using the app. Reminds us of the Philips Hue or other Bluetooth smart uh, light bulbs that we've seen in the past, and this is very similar in premise. The application itself is quite elegant and nicely designed. Everything is intuitive, and we didn't have any glitches that we encountered during the testing process either. Either. Again, you can change the glow quite evenly from the color scheme that you're looking for, as well as the brightness in this bar down below. I can also change it back to white light for a more traditional reading experience, or also to use it as the wake-up light functionality. On the top, if I tap on the settings, I can also change, again, the default turn-on color, the name, as well as contact support. Down below here, you have access to a few preset colors that you can go through. There's also an interesting multicolor mode, uh, more useful for the music playback functionality. Next, for notifications, you can turn this on or off through the settings, and you have access to notifications for your SMS text messages, incoming calls, Gmail support, calendar, Facebook, uh, Twitter notifications, uh, WeChat notifications, and so on and so forth. So it supports quite a few, and you can change the color for each of these so I can customize it. For instance, WeChat would be green, so if you're getting a green pulse, if it flashes green uh, from the typical white that I have it set at currently, that means I have a new message coming in. Uh, it allows you to 
to pretty elegantly know if you have a incoming text or a new notification. So if you're in a meeting, if you have it somewhere discreet, you can still access uh, kind of know to check your content later on. Over here, we have the music playback functionality. Uh, it uses this dedicated bar below to control your music as opposed to the regular MP3 player built on your phone. So it gets a little, it takes a little bit of time to get used to. This is one of the more clunkier aspects of the application. So for instance, I would tap on this music icon and then manually select the songs that I have uh, loaded on my phone to then play them back using the Naughty. Again, the Naughty itself doesn't have a Bluetooth speaker, so basically it just pulses uh, and uses the phone speaker. So it syncs up the lighting effect with your song or your music. So as a quick test, if we have, a, let's say, a quick clip loaded up, this is a mechanical keyboard kind of typing in the background, but as you can see there, the light actually pulses and flashes to the volume, so it gets brighter when the music or the audio is brighter, uh, and it changes back and forth between different color modes that you can pick. Uh, but the sound itself is coming out from the phone. Here we have the alarm functionality. You can set an alarm, change the color. I can make it reoccurring, also use it as a timer so it gets brighter uh, or gets uh, turned off after you know it rings and so on and so forth. And this works pretty well. It's fairly accurate. After you set a time and synced it with the Naughty, you can also turn off Bluetooth on your phone and the alarm will still work. So I have the unit turned off, for instance. The next morning at eight o'clock, even if my phone is out of power, uh, the Naughty will still start to flash this uh, white glow kind of simulating the sun. So it does work quite well and it's nicely designed in that aspect. When you're ready to turn it off, just tap on the W key for a few seconds and it will go off and save you some battery. So at the end of the day, I would say that the Noti a Smart Notification Light is a pretty interestingly designed product. Uh, the company Witty has produced, I think, a series of compelling smart notification lights for users to pick up. They kind of blend the edge again between art and technology, and even though the price point isn't the cheapest we've seen, and possibly getting a Bluetooth smart light bulb might be a cheaper option, this is something compelling if you're traveling and you want to take something with you without really having to look at your phone every five seconds to check if you have a new text message or a notification. Uh, also kind of is an alternative, I guess, to smart wearables and watches. You can check out more details about the Noti in our official written review, but this has been our video. Thanks for watching here at OS Reviews.